Greetings all, Vanna here for Scorpio's weekend message. Scorpio, this is a very special weekend because we have a new moon on the day I am recording and uploading these. And this weekend is the Lunar New Year, which means you, we are entering the Year of the Dragon, which is just awesome in general. And this is an incredible time to release old energies that keep you in this stuck mentality thinking that you're going to hurt yourself again if you step out. My love, hurt is part of life, and we can't let those things stop us from living ours. And I understand, sometimes we've gone through things that are very difficult to face, and it's created a lot of upset or mistrust in ourselves. Mistrust in what we believe we can do and what we believe we deserve. Perhaps by Leos or that prideful energy, narcissistic energy, but my love, you have an ability and the, ra the right to happiness. You have the ability to achieve your happiness and the right to have, it. yeah, right there. Happiness, 10 of diamonds. That is someone who has lived a very good life, a very fulfilled life. And you absolutely deserve that. So Scorpio, I can't even with you. The world really like, I was about to say, you deserve the world, and then it comes out. And Knight of Cups, valuing yourself, moving forward, and if it takes time, then it takes time. You have to move in the way that is best for you. And that will not look like what everyone else is doing. It won't look like what your family is doing. It won't look like what your spouse is doing. It won't look like what your coworkers are doing, because none of them are you. You, the Scorpio that is hearing me right now, is a unique individual. Someone that may have had to put themselves on the defensive or defend themselves and defend their right to go after what they love. But you have a right and the reason to go after what you love, whatever that is. For myself, it's freedom. It's independence. Knowing that if someone is with me, they are with me because they love me, not because one of us needs the other to survive. You have nine of crystals walking away from this situation, walking away from this hurt, and not knowing that you are not, it wasn't without reason. What you have experienced here has taught you many things about what you do want and what you don't want. And it can be very difficult to see the blessings in those hard things that happen to us, to see the lessons that we needed to learn when we go through these hardships, these heartaches, betrayals, and hurt. And... I am telling you, as someone who's done a lot of healing and work herself, there is a lesson or a blessing in every single thing that has happened to you. And that is very difficult to hear if you have experienced some very hard things. I am not denying that some people have experienced some horrible fucking things. And I am not trying to over, over like, simplify what you have gone through. No. You have gone through a war no one else has had to fight. And I see you for that. And I see how strong you are for making it through to the other side. Though it may not seem like it, you have conquered your war already. Spirit, what does the star seed have to say? Courageous peony. Multifaceted, unique nature. Let yourself be seen. Courageous. That is the word to describe you, Scorpio. Courageous. Star bathing, light body, star grid, transmission, and activation. Something about your energy, something about your psychic powers or abilities, or perhaps even a, just the talent of yours, how you meditate and communicate with spirit, it is coming online. And that's because the collective of us, the earth, the humans, and the souls that, em in that embody it, we are coming more online with mother. We are coming more online with her energy and her gifts. And as we are, our own are coming up very clear. Things like divination, seeing or sensing auras, reiki healing. You also have um, like people that have prophetic dreams or are mediums. Bridges to the other side to help people reach closure and communicate with their lost loved ones. There are people who are com Yes, exactly. Soul gifts and training. It is time for you to step up. You have a purpose. You have reasons 
to be here. Something about your experience, something about your journey and what you have survived is part of your strength and part of what you will share with the world. Perhaps you'll be starting like a, a woman's shelter so that people that are in an abusive relationship can get them and their children out in a safer place. Perhaps you will be starting a country's communications program, bridging misunderstandings between our war-torn world right now. You have Blue Fame, Spontaneous Awakening, Activation, and Integration Time. That's two cards of activation, and I feel like it might happen very spontaneously and quickly for you. It may be very jarring. Earth, learning how to be human in this world, but not of it. Yes, as I was saying, we are stars. We are of the stars. We are souls that embody a human vessel. We are not humans ourselves. When we, when this vessel, when this fleshy, fleshy meat sack passes on, we go back to spirit or we stay in another vessel, in another form. That is because our soul, the root of who we are, is so powerful, it cannot be destroyed. It goes on. It survives. It persists. You will not die. Understand that. And I think that takes away a lot of fear of doing spontaneous, crazy, or nonsensical things here in this world. Is that there is nothing to fear. Scorpio, you have a wonderful energy about you. And I actually feel like my ears are a lot clearer now. For like the beginning four minutes of this, it was all very cloudy. And like I had like cotton balls in my ears. But now I hear myself clearer. I I feel clearer in there and I feel like that noise that what was going on in that integration in that activation time has passed and on the other side it is clearer it is more powerful this is your power this is your gifts understand how the law of attraction works everything that you think say and feel becomes your reality becomes what you bring about in this world so as you are coming into your power understanding the power of your words that is why it is called spelling is because your words are magic and speak the world that you want into existence and claim it as if it is already here for you, Scorpio. These things and your courage will help you through these challenges and there will be nothing that can stop you and nothing that will bring you back to this place of weakness, of fear and doubt. You have long since abandoned that hurt. You have long since abandoned that insecurities and you are so much more powerful on the other side of this please push through my love it is always darkest before the dawn and you are worth the fight 